Welcome to this tutorial. In this tutorial, you are going to learn how to create uh, a simple form using uh, Python uh, on Colab. Colab is one of the most powerful research tools that uh, uh, used to develop a artificial intelligence, machine learning, and data science programs. So in this uh, tool, you can control the programs, the values of your data type, uh, uh, the variables and everything using graphical user interfaces. So you can design a control mechanism to control the values, the input uh, data using uh, form. So in this uh, tutorial, I will show you a step by step uh, uh, how to design a form uh, to control your uh, program values or data uh, values. Okay, let's get started. First of all, you need to just specify the title. This is the beginning to for, uh, design a simple form, form series. And at the end, you put hash ads. Okay, for example, first of all, let's design, uh, let's put a string type, a string type, and let's define default value for string type. For example, your name, okay? At the end, put hash at para. And finally, let's define the type of this input. So the user always uh, need to uh, enter that type of data. Okay. As you can see here, here, uh, the graphical user interface is created and I can input my name, for example, as when I input uh, data in the form, the values of that uh, in, uh, field is changed based on the uh, values uh, of the input form. Okay, so this is one of the control mechanisms that is used to control your input data in the input fields. Okay, let's add more. For example, checkbox is checked by default. Let's give false. And type is Boolean. OK. So this is, by default, it is false. But I checked on the checkbox, and the value of that uh, uh, variable is changed to true. OK. So this is the very interactive way to design uh, a form. And let's add more uh, types. For example, edge, pick edge. Default is 10, let's say. And the type of this is number. OK. I can change the value of the edge, for example, 32, and automatically change it, the values of edge variable here, when I input here. OK. That's good. Let's add more, for example, slider type. In a minimum end, the minimum value for slide is, is for example, 100. And param. And the type of this is slider. And let's give minimum of the slider is 100 and max is 200. OK, you see the default uh, initial value is uh, 100 and maximum is 200. Then I can slide to any value and pick uh, that uh, slide value. And automatically, the slider value is changed to that uh, selected slide or from the form, OK? For example, here, 153. 153 is changed in the input field uh, variable, OK? For example, let's uh, design a date picker. Uh, let's input default date. Uh, 
type is date. Yeah, as you can see here, you can pick the dates from date speaker. For example, today's date is 15, 5th uh, month, and 2023. Okay. Uh, and uh, day, day picker, uh, default is Monday. Let's give default value for day is Monday. And let's list out the day, Monday, this day. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and and the last day is Sunday. Okay, and automatically just uh, put in the drop down when I put in the list, and I can pick. For example, the default is Monday and I can pick Tuesday and the date is changed to, the day value is changed to Tuesday. So you can pick any date and like this. For example, let's add one more uh, favorite pick, pick favorite fruits. Okay. Default value is Apple, and you can pick more favorite Apple. Okay, orange. Banana. Uh, automatically just uh, put in the drop down of the form okay this is the way how you can design uh, input form uh, using uh, collab uh, tool so it is very very interesting and you can just control the input values of the variables in your uh, python program or any data science or artificial intelligence program using the such kind of uh, forms by designing such kind of forms. So uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, like, share, subscribe the video. Thanks for watching today.